All right. So I'm back, and I thought, you know, why why not do a video on a VST plugin? Because I just downloaded this one. It's called Eastern One. And, uh, you know, I'm going to do something with my vocal effects real quick. Let's add, um, oh, what was it called? There's something in, oh, here it is, vocal, uh, brass cinematic, let's bring it over here, there was something that, it was a quill comp effect, I think, not harvester, not simulator, not bagpipes, not pseudonym, kettle drum, you know what, it was a, it was a effects plug-in, BFP. Chorus, flooper, digger, do, kazoo, vocoral. This is it. So here's a uh, vocoral. Yeah, all of a sudden you hear it. Let's turn the reverb off. This plugin allows you to. This plugin allows you to have 20 voices. That's what you hear. satisfied with the volume of my vocal. So let's do something about it. And you know what? There's also the keyboard probably needs to be, let's bring the mixer up. Uh, the keyboard probably needs to come down. Man, you know, look at that. It's already right there. That's weird. Okay. So, uh, maybe it's okay. Alright, well loud. Okay. Oh. Oh, oh. Why am I doing that? Control it from here. Um, so, we're just getting used to uh, using the keyboard as a DAW controller. I've always used the keyboard as a MIDI controller. 
controller, but this is the first one I've had that has DAW control capability built into the surface. Okay, so that's just a little bit too much. Let's go down just a little bit. All right, so. Um, hopefully that sounds loud enough. If not, then I'm just going to make vlogs with peaking and not worry about the peaking. So, um, you know what? I don't think it is loud enough in the... So just do it. All right, so let's um, look at some of these other instruments. I'm going to do this, though. I'm going to go into... So let's bring up... Uh, add... We're going to add what? Let's go to the very end of all plugins. Whoa, this is going to be crazy. Um, this might be too much. Whoa, hey. Max. You know, let's turn this one off. Remove that. Now, we're just going to use this one. Hello, hello. Man, this is very effective. Okay, I'd say that this definitely is helping. But boy, it adds a lot of white noise. Okay, I'm just going to be satisfied with this. And we'll see what it sounds like after it's uploaded to YouTube. Especially compared to, like, CNN's YouTube channel and listening to news reporters. See what the level sounds like in comparison to the voice that I'm using for my vlogs, which is my own voice. Oh, Okay, so, um, back to this. Boy, there is a lot of white noise in that. I don't know if it'll be identifiable um, when we uh, actually go to upload to YouTube. You know, maybe it's all right. Let's look at this. Let's go. Let's go to Windows again. I always just do this just for fun. Mm, Windows, and then where are you? Sound. Okay, here we go. Okay. Default playback device. Okay, levels. Yep. Okay, playback. Levels. We're good. Okay, what about good there. Everything's good down here. Uh, hmm. Everything's good. Man. Okay, so we go back into Reaper. This is set all the way up. Go back into Reaper here. All right, so. I think I just figured out the secret of Nim. Uh, yeah, that's what that was. Okay, so. Um, Let's see here. The, the next instrument, this is vocal. We need keyboard. Yeah. Let's check it out. Accordion. This is an accordion. So I guess there's certain instruments that are commonly used in the West that are also used in the East, and, I, and the accordion's one of them. Wow. Okay. So where'd that uh, vocal effect thing go? Here we go. Ah, there it is. You know, I really don't know how much volume adjustment to apply. 
but that's okay. We'll figure it out. We're gonna figure it out. Let's. This is. We're gonna say 30. This is the 30 mark, and we'll see how. I mean, the keyboard still sounds pretty loud. Okay, so there's that. Let's close that. Okay, so next instrument. Now oh, this is a really interesting plug-in. I'm surprised I'm just now discovering it. Okay, so there's three accordions on this. That's an accordion. Okay. Semesmia to Semesmia. Looks like something you either strike with an instrument or you shake it or something. Semenstia. Okay, so Medjwitz. This is Medjwitz. Looks like some sort of a uh, wind instrument. Or like a reed instrument. articulations down on the end. Interesting. Okay, so on to the next one. So that was the Medjwitz. So these are all uh, Far East. Um, all these instruments. So this looks like some sort of uh, wind. So these are more articulations. These are like that initial transient uh, whistle that you get when you first start blowing into the reed. And then there's longs that start here at this, uh, I guess that's C. These are longs. Beautiful instrument. Nay. It's called a nay. Okay. Kanoon. Looks like a hammer dulcimer or a cymbalum. So this is called a kanoon. Q A N O O N. Okay, that's a canoon. Uh, Cayman. Oh, so this is essentially a violin. I like how this app has little articulations on one far end of the keyboard if the instrument's range isn't very long. Okay, so we're going to keep on looking here. Cayman. Here's two. I guess this is a minor. Oh, so it's just 
all articulations across the keyboard. Okay, major. So this is more articulations across the keyboard. Santour. So this is a santour. Very Asian-y. Cool. Um, okay, so that's Sun Tour One. There's more, there's two. I think the just moved it an octave further up. Okay, so clarinet. This is the last one. Uh -huh. That's an articulation down here. So that's, that's the lowest end of the clarinet is right here. Goes all the way to the 88th key. Pretty wide, pretty wide range. awesome sound on clarinet. Okay, I guess that's it for this video. Um, uh, you know, I don't care about views and people, so I don't care if you subscribe to my YouTube channel at all, because I'm not making any money off this. So, have a good day!